So the first thing that we have to do is to draw the shape and choose the rectangle with the corner one. Okay. So after we draw this, we're gonna click on this yellow point to uh, make the corner is round. And we move to here. And we just hold control key to uh, drag, duplicate the elements. Just doing like that. So now we gonna select all and choose the alignment to make it uh, perfectly aligned into the single row column. And then we're going to copy the color codes to each of these elements. And paste here. Okay. So we have to do all in these elements to each color. So then now we're going to remove the outline and place the apply the shadow and we can change the setting in here so I'm going to uh, resize some kind of stuff in there and add this some text the text that we're going to add is the number that we're going to place like topic you want to talk about or something like that so we just design the font and change the color style as well then we have to hold the control key to copy those uh, elements to each of the element that we can see that we just play over there and just change to the number authoring number and then we're going to add the text that we want to uh, talk about something so we just add a little text over there okay this is just a mock data so I just copy from somewhere else and just paste it for the demonstration so we just copy those elements to each of uh, the element that you uh, over there you just hold the shift key when you move the mouse so it's gonna be it's gonna be moved at the same column as well so for the last one it's just like a topic that you want to cover on the first two second third and fourth like that so I just place the recipe for cooking tutorial or something like that and we change the color the same as the color background And then I'm going to add in the uh, elements at the uh, left here. Okay, we just remove the outline if it exists, just remove it and add the shadow shape as well. Alright, so we just copy that uh, text to place inside this one. And then we're going to um, write down some uh, topic or some kind of uh, text that you want to you want to cover on it. and then we're going to insert the icon the free icon in here so we just place going to place this fork and the knife here and we change the graphic color to the white and place in the middle of this circle so then we're going to grouping this by just select all the elements in one and then press ctrl G to group
Okay, so we're going to duplicate this slide to make the animation. So um, I'm going to select all of this element, and then we're going to align it into place into the one alignment. Okay, like that. So we stay on each other, and then we're going to apply duplicate in another one, and select all this element, move it to up here, and then for the third, we're going to do that. So in ordering, we have to move the slide. So first, we're going to show the middle one first, and the second, and the second, and then the last here. You can see in the middle, and then it's gonna be move move to the top, and then show all the topics okay we're going to apply the moth okay so now we're going to uh, see the result okay first we just move it to the top and then show all this uh, topic here okay this one just reverse so we're going to add the same in another animation so we're going to copy move out from the presentation slide like that and we're not going to move with the same uh, same speed so we have to do like that it's gonna be move the animate gonna be moved to the right in a different speed Okay, move over here. And for the left here, we also do that. Okay, so just move this first. And for the title, just hold the shift key and move it. Okay, so just apply the move transition and you can see that. Okay, so it just moved that and then you can put some text or some another slide to show the to present to the, your audience. Okay, thank you for watching for this video. Please subscribe, like and sharing to your friends. And the download resource in the description, you can go into the link and download it from the uh, Google Doc. So thank you and see you in the next video.